Hi YouTube, that's my car. That's a 2002 BMW E46, 325i, so nothing really special. And today we're gonna be washing my car with a power washer. A bottle we got from Amazon for the power washer. And then some chemical guys. Honeydew snow foam. So this was just off Amazon. It's like 13 bucks, not bad. This was like 23, I think, like on sale, something like that. Power washer, you can get them at any real like department store. Uh, you don't really gotta get anything special, anything that can adapt to the nozzle. And yeah, we're gonna be washing my car today. We're gonna use just water, then the foam, and then just spray it off, dry it off. Maybe quick wax, not sure yet. Uh, we'll see how it goes. And yeah, today's my first YouTube day. Uh, I'm gonna try to do my best with this. I want to try to start up YouTube, but don't know where I'm gonna head with it yet. Uh, I have kind of an idea in my head. Um, today you guys are gonna learn about me a little bit, uh, what I stand for, where I want this channel to go, what I'm trying to do with this channel. Uh, so yeah, today you guys may see me not exactly looking at the camera as much, but I promise you it's gonna get better. Stay tuned. Uh, yeah, subscribe. Give me any comments. Tell me how I can do better. I'd love that. So yeah. Damn. So here's a quick rundown of my car and all the things that I have on it. Uh, nothing, nothing too crazy. I got a license plate tow hook holder. I added that on. Some Chrome Spider Pro LED HID whatever headlights from SpiderAuto.com. Those are awesome. Blue plastic dip for the mirrors and all the handles. Now this was just something custom I kind of did. Uh, simple plastic dip job, tape it, tape it off a little bit, and just take your time. Nothing too crazy, I'm sure you guys can find some videos about that. It is lowered, my car is lowered on Racelands, Racelands right here. Check them out, Raceland. Uh, one thing I had to do, upgrade all the strut mounts because as soon as you change them to coilovers, immediately your strut mounts are going to blow. Right here, you can see the kicker speakers. I have all brand new, I think eight speakers. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight brand new kicker speakers in this car. Still working on it, possibly sub, I don't know yet. Depends where I wanna go with this car. The low on here is only maybe, I can only stick like maybe a finger in. Yeah, yeah. That was a quick rundown of the exterior. Now inside, everybody always talks about the blue interior. Now on the 325i, it's supposed to be wooden. And all I did was just take off these interior trim pieces. You can just pop them right out. Uh, find either a screwdriver, the plastic trim removers, anything works. And you can pop them out. I just lay them down on the ground. Plastic dip them the same exact color as my handles and mirrors and yeah quick job nothing too crazy plastic dip all has some clear coat on top nothing too bad so yeah i'm gonna start washing it down right now with water uh after water foam after the foam dry off probably my friend's probably gonna get here we're gonna wash his car too Yeah, so that's really hard to do with one hand. So I'm gonna put you guys down. Uh, probably not gonna film it because all I'm really doing is just spraying the car with water. And yeah, so I'll show you guys after when I'm actually foaming down the car. Because that foam, I'm really excited to try. 
Shout out to Chemical Guys. Okay, so this is really heavy just for one hand to hold. Uh, you can see the foam is kind of all right. The foam gun itself, eh. Maybe if I learn how to actually use it. Well, I'll give you guys a short demonstration. Let me just switch hands. Okay, let's see if this works. Does this work? Yeah, this works. You guys get like a first person sort of view. Not what I expected. But it's not bad, it's not bad. So I'm gonna foam down the whole car now, and yeah, I'll get back to you guys. Uh, on the rims, it did a pretty good job actually. Not too terrible. Two months ago and it's still perfectly beating. And living up in New England, like, I live in Connecticut. So, uh, there's a lot of salt on the roads. Uh, when winter time comes, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm probably gonna have to detail my whole car fully, protect it, seal it, put an extra coat of wax on it, just so that I don't get any more rust spots because I do have really bad rust. I'll actually show you guys that right now. Right here. There's some rust right there. My car isn't perfect. Some rust right there. You guys can see that. Rust spot right here too. And a rust spot right there. But yeah. Oh, and here, my car was banged up a little bit. I was reversing out of a garage and cut the wheel a little too hard and kind of went into the side of the garage. But you know, it's all good. Cause you know, it's only, it's only a body panel. It doesn't even matter. I could replace that. I could replace my whole front bumper if I wanted to, but you know, it's just an option. Uh, rust spots and dents like that don't really phase me. I have a lot of dents in my car. Okay, maybe not a lot compared to other people, but I have a decent amount of dents. Decent amount to where I wouldn't consider this car a show car by any means. This car is by any means anything but a show car. It is just a daily driver. I drive it every day. It's my car. It's, it's my baby, so. I use her every day, and yeah, still looking clean. Huge ass bumblebee in my garage. Oh, you're huge. I'm gonna get away from you, but yeah. The foam, oh, amazing. So here is the finished product after letting it sit out for a little bit after I dried it off. Damn, I think it looks a hundred percent more clean Especially cleaner than last time And it's a lot quicker. This only took me maybe like 15 minutes Like that's with filming this too 15 minutes So as I was editing the video, I totally forgot I never said goodbye and I didn't even say what my name was My name is Eric Lee. I want to start up YouTube. Here's my car it's all clean, all dried off. See, it looks very clean right now. And yeah, I hope you guys will join me on my journey. Uh, there's a lot more content coming up. I have a lot of great ideas. My next video will be talking about the channel, where I want to go with it. And yeah, I'm going to tell you guys what I have in store. It's only some of the things though, because that's a secret. Alright, I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.